Alright, we're immediately back. This is like two seconds after ending the last recording. It's just the episode was getting long, and I know people, some people in the comments have been saying that it's a bad trend to have episodes too long. I get it. We release an episode every day. You don't want to watch a two hour video every day. Alright. Alright, let's get back then, yeah. No smoke bomb? I gotta swap. There's a Sparzy. We found one. You're fine. Yeah, do your swap. A level 39? Holy crap. I told you, dude, the Galvanids are low level. I caught a level 40 Galvanid. The Sparzy's the one that's 39, but yes. Okay, but the Galvanid's also 41. 41 so Galvanid, mean. yeah. Oof. For whatever reason, the Antlings are much higher level. Let's go Balash. Double speed down, and I bet you he's still faster than all these Temtem, or at least most of them. He's a quick boy. He's a fast boy. Don't do anything. I want to try something. Okay, never mind. You can hit Galvin. You can hit a Galvin. Spark, he's dying. <clears throat> Double speed down, and we're still out here. That's my boy Velash. He's the surprise yeah, hit for me, me to be Thank honest. Thank you, I appreciate that. For real. Ten percent too, so this should be a full heal. Yeah. <laughs> nice. That helped a lot. I, I mean, you know. That went really well. Putting Velosh in front. So today we go Get to lane. the city. I'm so glad to be here, by the way. This fifth island is dope so far. Hey, we get some experience from this one. Hey. I'm just going to stand and watch. With Velosh out against Electrics, that's what I expect you to be able to do, yeah. Kratos gonna hit 48 next one. This could be a long grind. I don't think you do quite understand how frustrating it is sometimes just sitting watching another person play the game. I have faster Tem. It's helpful, it, it's, it's nice. It's you nothing. Just have, your, your Tem are all so fast. Most of them, yeah. It's shocking how many of your Tem have gotten speed and mine haven't. Kratos and that's 48. Fine. It is what it is, especially when you're Nuzlocking like this. Right. I get you. Well, I would have like, had a chance. Every, every once in a while, it's like, God, I wish I'd be able to sit and play. Like. I get you. So I want to see what some of these moves would do. Yep. Yeah. yeah. No, right, he... now we can actually go... Neo Ito! Isn't he the best boy? The bestest boy! That's right, now don't get too excited, Zierbo. Settle down. We have teleporters Let's in here. Teleport. They oh, teleport. What the hell? What the hell is this technology? Bred by someone, this Temtem is useful for something. Do you ever wonder who writes for the Tempedia? Huh? Yeah, you know, there's bits you get in your Tempedia. You're a tamer too, right? Think about it. Thousands of tamers read that on the daily. Whose job is it to write that? Must be someone incredibly smart and sexy. Yeah, that's right. What the hell? How do you get inside? Oh, there's multiple stories here. Yep. You have to figure out how to get down to the down... Oh, okay. There was a building. Oh my god, the, this TV! Oh my god! These people are lounging! <laughs> What? <laughs> Let's explore up here first, then we'll go downstairs. Yeah, yeah, it sounds good. This is so cool. Dude, the city's nuts. Okay, that's down below. Uh-huh. Okay, this one's here. A lot of exploring to do here. Nope, Fridge is empty here. again, I swear. One day I'll catch them. Who? Those pesky dudes from that downstairs co-working thing. Sometimes they sneak in and eat my snacks. Messed up. Oh, there's the dojo. Let's avoid that. Avoid, avoid. Don't go up.
We can go up without going to the dojo. Maybe. Better safe than sorry. Well, okay. Just gonna blend in. Riveting gameplay. Don't mind if I sit for a spell, dear. My legs are a bit sore, growing pains. <laughs> growing pains, okay. Sure. Uh. Mm. Interesting. That's the door I was about to go in. Exclamation point door. It's Crema, staff only. <laughs> this is this is their self insert building. Question yep, mark all the major here. devs are in here. I bet. Oh, it's Damien. They said the melody sounded like a newscast intro. The composer? Yes, I. Wow, I didn't know I was famous. The last you to come say hi. I'm flattered. No kid who really knows your work. Oh, really? Well, my goodness, it's so heartwarming. Is there anything I can do for them? Absolutely, I'd love to. Here, I think I had the sheet music somewhere around here. Oh no, where is it now? Oh, I can't find it. Why don't you ask Macro Burla, Burla over there? He keeps a lot of sheets. Maybe he knows where it is. Who the hell is Macro Burla? Boom crash. Yes, I have it right here. Somewhere. I mean, I can help you look for it, but I'm busy right now. I'm trying to get all these sound effects just right, but it's tricky. Give me a hand and I'll help you. Really, just grab that mic, that one. Don't stand too close to it. Try not to breathe into it. I need a bright, clear clink sound for when you pick up this coin. Ready? Go. Okay, next one. You need a good old flumpsh. Like this big machine is passing you by real close. A lot of tension to it, you know? That's close to the mic. Yeah, like that. Okay, next one. Really big final boss explosion like kaboom blam Got it? Yes, they all sound like that. Okay, okay, not bad. Very good. And now sing the Temtem Up song. <laughs> Exploring this world of wonder. It's time to pick our starter and Temtem Up. I don't know the song. Brilliant. Okay, about that sheet music. I think it was here. Ah, oh, there it is. Got Damien's score. Okay. Intro for the famous anime series penned by Damien himself. We play the song for Peyton on those musical crystals. Let's go back to Barafu Glacier. Yeah, one day. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Yaw, as you can clearly see. Above, I'm the game director, but that doesn't matter. You gotta go downstairs to get the sandwiches. Every day I randomize who gets who goes to get the sandwiches. Your turn today. Sorry, the RNG gods have spoken. Get the sandwiches, please. Because it's not my turn. In fact, it's never my turn. That's just how randomness works. Sorry. <laughs> Someone's poking fun at this man. Get disgusting. You have to go get sandwiches. It's your turn. Hurry up. The team is hungry. <laughs> okay. With a Luma Momo. No less. This guy looks like me. But angry. Check what? Yeah, and good looking. Don't worry. He's a Temtem character. None of them are good looking. It was a joke. None of them are good looking. None of them. Shrine? What shrine? One of the cave right up ahead. It's a very ancient shrine dedicated to the Kami spirits to protect the island. Well, it used to be. In any case, it's a great place, great power. If only we can harness it after first repairing it, if that's the correct word. We am also ashamed to admit it was our fault. We wanted to study the place of power to harness its properties for the development of better t digital Temtem. We built some machinery in there and everything should theoretically be working, but it just stopped. The power's gone. There's no scientific explanation for it. The priest came by a few days ago, said the Kami were angry with us. They don't like us meddling with their shrine. Well, that's what the priest said. I don't know. To be honest, we're at a loss as to what happened. The only one who seems to have an inkling is uh, that priest, I suppose. Won't accept such non-scientific reasoning. Which I don't, Which naturally. Which I don't. But we're running out of ideas, so perhaps you can go ask the priest? She's a hermit with a certain reputation for being a bit out there in every sense. This issue usually roams the pillars of high above. She had an argument with the big man of Bianco Village. Those are two places we have not been. So now she's wandering a pilgrim of sorts. Thanks, Taco. I promise I'll give you full access to her experimental material at the shrine as soon as it's solved. Alright. Staff entrance to the Nanto Labs. Heavily guarded, as expected. Crystal Tem. Digital Tem. That's what I meant. Okay, we're gonna have to repeat the last endurance test. Sorry, I wasn't recording. <laughs> hey, you are. are you a tamer by any chance? Are you busy at the moment? My colleague Mirai needs someone who can help her with field work. She's trying to introduce a new species to the rice field, so between you and me, she's more of a lab denizen than a field researcher. You'll see if she needs a hand, will you? Or I'll be working on this on my own for the rest of the month. Don't call me that. I'm not a dojo master. It makes me feel old. True. 
Saying ma'am outside the Where south is weird. Oh, uh, she's out in the field. That's what she said. Oh. Well, that would make sense. Don't know where the fields are. Work in progress. Okay, so now all we have left is stuff downstairs. All right, does this teleport us down? Probably not. Yes, it does. Oh, why? Well, yes, it does. Or up. You still there? Yeah. Uh, this guy's asking uh, why this would be the most technological place. I'm going to say a unique combination of traditional expertise with electric that provided the foundation for the joint efforts of Dr. Himijo, Professor Constantinos, and many others to create the first digital temptems. Wow. Deep. Not that, really. It's very surface level. Temporium. <laughs> Just hang out until the ship starts. Okay. So many slots that we can't use. 450 slots, that's funny. <laughs> they went, we're going to stop this, do a quest every place you visit. Here's 450 slots. I now have a full box. Not a single slot remaining. My next Temtem -tem will go oh, into box two. Oh, we got some two. new stuff. Bomb plus plus. Hell yeah. Plus plus. Tem card plus plus. Now we're talking. I'm going to buy three dozen, two dozen bomb plus plus for 17,000. I'm still not fully ready for the bomb plus pluses. I'm going to buy seven Tem card plus pluses so that I'm at a dozen even. I don't want to waste my full restores because we only get so many, and the bomb plus is starting to get too weak to be good. So I'm stocking up on the bomb plus pluses. Max scent never tested on Temtem or humans. This concentrated fragrance is a weapons grade repellent. Immense reduction of untamed encounters for a while. <laughs> I grabbed me ten, just in Max case we get to that place where we do not want to I, find something. I grabbed one because it made me laugh. Sticker. Sticker. Both got I stickers. I've been looking for those. Okay, I guess we're going back up. Oh, there's a sticker right here. There's the next place that it won't so let us out. Panky Kabuki. <laughs> uh, 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 hoi? Mint Aoi condition. Ao high. Ao high. Brand fashions. Interesting. This is my favorite city. The weeb in me is loving this. Sure. Oh, Cut you out, okay? <laughs> yeah, apparently, that's upstairs. Until we find where there's one. Of, ah! Why would you do this? Mangaka. Mangaka. Okay. You're a mangaka. So you're a fan of Endera's quest then? It's very nice. Thank you. It's a hard job. You know, it's heartwarming to see her that people love what I do. Can I have that in their sign? Thanks for stopping by. We did it. She's going to love it. The bed is in there. <laughs> Literally, the bed is in there. <laughs> Whoa. This is the girl for a room too. She's got a whole treadmill. Finish looking down below. Jeez, dude. Oh, sorry. Do you want to go back in? No, I don't want to talk to this guy. Fight the good fight. <laughs> you won't have a second chance. I'm going for it. Right here, no need to shout. It was against the wall with the Moomy Garrison isolated under constant attack from Thurl through the tunnel, so I was sent to Scout West through the. Gino Gap. We managed to join the resistance forces at Upanzani, and from there we launched the final blow Operation Tusk. We infiltrated the great city of Uhuru, and there we had the final battle against General X. 
And what lessons can we learn from Kisu, a cute congressional agent? We all need to work together. Dark times are coming. <laughs> support the Congress. You still support the Archipelagic Congress. We need everyone to work together to leave their differences aside and unite against Clan Bel Soto. Win together or be defeated alone. Long live the Congress, long live... Man, if only politics was that easy. Thanks for coming, everyone. That was a magnificent speech, Sataka. I didn't know you were such a great orator. Look, These are all my savings. I was planning to use them to go to Kiso and enjoy the Congress, but now I know you make better use of them. Please. Whoa! Dude, Satoru's mad on Congress's side. Are you kidding me? Gee, yeah, no kidding. Thanks, dude. What an avid supporter. That's crazy. That's loco. Did he say something about not being in his home? Oh, look at this guy's got a nice setup, actually. I would live here. Minus the the, the crap-looking bed. Then again, I don't even use comforters and stuff, so... Who am I to, who am I to talk? What the hell is this? What, tarnation? Temtem Registration Bureau. First off, what Temtem are you here about today? What am I doing? I'm registering Bubba! You're the original tamer of this Temtem. This definitely makes things easier on our side. Bro, I can edit the registry to change that Temtem's official name for fee of 2,000. Let me think about it. Okay, so it's 2,000 sons to change the name. Now we know. Alright, well that's not worth it. You can also get renaming tickets, but yeah. Neo Edo Place Hotel. Oh. Uh, I'm staying at the labs, I guess. Well, you and I went different routes on that one. I said a shame. Huh. Where are you? I went upstairs. Where'd you go? I also went upstairs. I just didn't see you up there. That was weird. That was weird. What is this? Good eye, I almost missed that building. Pretty dojo manager. Promotion has itself. Just doing routine checks to be a safety protocol say so there should be someone present. Just want to press the console to the one best UX design uniface. Beautifying. User typo. I see. Well there's one way to use There's one name. way to spell your kudo use your kudos, yeah. Wow. There's like poses you couldn't choose in character creation. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this. You see how much what, this stuff costs? What is this evil Frieza stance I'm doing? <laughs> Naruto running? Come on! <laughs> my god. Go to style bottom left. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't have that available that's, to me. That's funny. Are we looking at different oh, there options? It is. Yes, no, I've got it now. 4,500. Alright, well we found where we need to go. If There's we the heads, stuff. yep. Body type, got it. Color, uh-huh. And then that boxer stance is pretty cool. Oh, that running animation's garbage, though. And the, and the stance for the Frieza stance is cool, but the run is awful. Oh my god. That's ridiculous. I love it. Izakaya87 is open. Did you run in that? I, did. I didn't run. Okay, I was gonna say I didn't do that. Don't talk to me. Gotta stay focused, sharp, in the zone. A bunch of sandwiches. Game dev is hungry work. I wonder if it will ever be y'all's turn to pick up the sandwiches. Man, they're really giving them a hard time about never being <laughs> picked to get the sandwiches. Is this Ash Ketchup? What's up? Just my usual. I travel from one place to the next. Doing odd jobs, challenging dojo masters, beating them sometimes. Although while polishing my tamer skills, sounds familiar. Yeah, you, you notice how many people just give you odd jobs and requests for help as soon as you meet them? Makes you wonder what would happen if us wandering timbers just stayed home, you know? It's like being a knight errant of times of yore. Anyway, I think I'm gonna have, a, gonna have one last one. Yeah, nobody else says anything of value. Okay.
Did we already go in here and check this one? Probably not. No. Fridge just up and disappeared. <laughs> the fridge up and disappeared. How? Does a fridge up and disappear? Well, did we... Are we sure this isn't the right place? Whatever it is, trying to be done with unpacking today. Ibrahima. I'd appreciate that. Yeah, can't find their TV remote or my laptop or my phone. This is a mess. Help him find his stuff. Of course it won't have batteries, yeah. Here's his phone right under this note right under his nose, this guy. Laptop's just here. Found all the Ibrahim's stuff. Good job. Oh by well, the pants on, where are they hiding? Thank you so much, buddy. Now I remember what I was. Did you find that manga volume three of Teray's Revenge? Yeah, no, I don't think it's here. I lent to that guy upstairs. Can't remember his name. It seemed a friendly thing to do, but could you go get it back for me, please? It's sort of awkward, you know. Thanks, you're a stand up guy. For real. Why are we doing this? Because it's a quest. We're knight errant. We're gonna have a housemate. That manga is nowhere to be seen. His manga is definitely not here. Time to bother that Malote dude. So you didn't find it, huh? I was thinking, I threw a party last night, and I think, well, memory's a little hazy, but I think so. <laughs> he got wasted. As we think of borrow that volume, dude, you, you lent Ibrahima's book to someone else? I know, it's not cool. Don't tell him, please. He's a nice dude. Just find it and return it to him without mentioning this little mistake, please. Thing is, I'm not really sure who it was. Brilliant. How do I find it, then? It was a girl. Like, she was talking about this anime for ages. I didn't ask her her name. Maybe I did, but I have a bad memory. You know, good for faces, bad for names. Anyway, she's a local, lives in the neighborhood. Just ask around, yeah? Sure, I'll ask around. Do I have a choice? I need to harsh my mellow, buddy. Yeah, thanks, dude. Yeah, real nice. Because somebody doesn't like to do side quests. What? I talked to... What are you talking about? I did all the conversation. What are you on about? Now you're just making things up blatantly. This bit. Oh, hi. You're new in town. Nice to meet you. It's here. Thank you. Please thank Melote for me and tell him I really liked it. Actually, it's Ibrahima's. Who's that? I don't think she cares. Important work we're doing here. For sure. For sure. Glad we could be this guy. <clears throat> My manga? Buddy, you're a star. <laughs> you're very nice. Anyone told you that? Real good egg. I travel a lot because of my job, you know. I never told you to get used to the cost of packing and unpacking, but it doesn't get to me as much as it used to. My wife couldn't stand me. So you know what I do? I use this meditation technique. It's not really meditation meditation, but whatever. It works. It makes me feel super fresh and at peace, you know. Have a minute and I can teach you how to do it. It's real simple. You take a deep breath in like this. You visualize the pants. It's slowly rotating. You imagine it's filling you like an amber energy. Refresh. Nice. No, that's not... That's not... I mean... Eh... Uh... It's okay, not something. Yeah, I mean, if you're special attack buffing, sure. <laughs> Just as stressed as before. <laughs> All right, That's we're fun. almost done exploring, but down below. Yeah. The lower evolution of Sparzy. Sparsley. <laughs> All right, this is the Digital Research and Development Center. This is Crema, main entrance. And that's decor for your house. No need. <clears throat> what the hell? What's with all the babungas? I look forward to exploring this on my own time, a long time from now. Coders are starving. You don't want to see them when they're starving. I think I'll eat these myself. <laughs> Guys, food is here. Okay, now I can finish this list of features. Most definitely include fishing. Yeah, you're right. That's what captains do when they're relaxing. They fish. There, in goes fishing. 
As far as we have crafting, dating, mole customization, airship stunt competitions, and fishing, of course. Depends. Do you mean the story or the mechanics? I more or less know what you will do in the game. It's an airship sim, after all. The problem is we still haven't figured out why or where. That's Professor Victor's job. He's the narrative guy. Can you both go poke him and see if he has anything? Where'd you go? To the first floor, so I can poke this man. It's not here. It must be the third floor. Why would he be in the factory? But he is. Not now. I'm trying to figure out if we need three acts or what. But you can call me the lore master. Guilty as charged. Your honor, what's up then? Well, don't tell me we're out of pre-pro so soon. Down below, take me. I was still polishing some aspects of the general world building. I still haven't figured out even the sketchiest idea about the general macroeconomic environment of our in-game world. Okay, here's the pitch. In this game universe, people live on islands floating on water instead of in the air, and all those islands are on the surface of a massive ball instead of an archipelago. So far so good. <laughs> so what does the setting suggest their need? Fishing? Because of the big oceans? Yeah, I guess. Thinking I was already considering some mechanics for fishing, so this will tie in nicely. What else? Nice one, but we need to give it some new spin. After all, spheric world is very easy to explore, right? So all the cultures probably already came in contact ages ago. They had to learn how to live in peace. So probably a very strong culture of cooperation and tolerance. Good, I love that. Should inform the gameplay too. Emphasis on finding stories and uncovering secrets. Rewarding that. Just need to develop these concepts a little bit more. Create some lore, and then the most important bit, draw some maps. Yes, look, that's my first rough idea for the first continent. <laughs> I know, right? Wait, does y'all want this for today? Story of my life. Oof. Come on, Vic. Think of something think of something fast. This needs to be delivered today. That will take me now. I'm too blocked to think of anything else. No, come on. I don't have time now. Come to think of it. What gives? Yeah, sure. I'll need to switch my inner critic off. Let's run outside for a second and tempt him up. Might be just the thing I need. I'm so prepared. I have no idea what my attempts are right now. I'm a little worried about this myself. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Uh, Oh, my team is awful. Dude, look at their levels. Okay, good. I needed that. Perania? I mean, they're both going to be threats to tank, but yeah. Which one? They're both threats to tank. I'm really worried about that, but yeah. Uh, Perania's fine, yeah. I got it. Let's go Velosh, man! Nice. And he doesn't have a water move on turn one, so... Grandpapa! Grandpapa. I'm gonna I'm bite that. Prepare to get bit! Now, if only Velash had more stamina. If only Tank had more stamina. Prepare to get bit. Hey, Glass Blade is super effective here. It's only six stamina. Not very good, but it's six stamina. Let's go! Yeah, good thing he's awful. Bro, what? That was a six stamina move. I know it was double and we're way over leveled, but damn. Okay, Velosh? You know, I'm a writer and not a tamer. <laughs> that was refreshing. It converts my thoughts I should keep Temtem fighting as a hobby. <laughs> right, I'll have a coffee or ten and get back to work. So much to write. You can tell y'all have the whole lot by EOD with maps even. Okay. <clears throat> the wrong place sorry you're good i'm black you're screened. Enjoying running these errands i'm black screened so am i sugar honey iced tea damn I it went or out of this yep. gosh darn it oh my god dr pepper is so good it's insane oh Oh! Dude. Dude, 
dude, we're not together. Yeah, my bad, my bad, my bad. Just talk to him. Oh, I'll, I'm gonna say not yet. Here, there, got it. Nice. All right, now let me put Bubba in front, just in case we get in another fight. <clears throat> Even though Velosh is cooking right now, man needs some TVs, but he's cooking. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> what? <laughs> Invigorated, so it uses less stamina when it attacks. I might need to put that on Velosh. Let's go. I'm going to put that on him right now. <laughs> now, and guys, guys, calm down. <clears throat> Too much light here? Is that what he just said? That is what he said. <gasps> the heck? <clears throat> we just got an Ori to turn in. Quest six. Attack T. Changes the Temtem's second type to the type to the technique it's about to use. Excuse me? So it always has stab, and it changes its typing constantly throughout the fight. Who do we have to turn that into? <clears throat> That's crazy. I'll have to go get that so we can even turn it in. But you said we have to turn it in. I don't know who, who we have to turn it into. Oh my god, there's so much to do here. <laughs> well, I'm sure they enjoyed their self-insert, you know what I mean? Oh, clearly. Playing World of Temcraft. So they have someone on the development team, clearly, that plays too much World of Warcraft and comes to, comes to work sleepy. Waiting for the code to send us a build. Okay. How are you with the player character rigging? This one just isn't working for me. I'm totally stuck. The protagonist of Omnidation Explorers in Chapter 24. So are you guys talking to me? I can't hear you if you speak from that side. <clears throat> Deaf in one ear. Okay. I think I know you. Aren't you the protagonist from that manga? The one about a young Tamer who's kidnapped on Pr his Apprentice's Eve? Totally a manga character. Yep. Anyway, since you're here, do you mind staying right where you are? We need to get some references to animate the main character. You know, give me a second to get ready. Guys, are you saying something? Okay, let's start small. Here, players just want to race against a rival airship captain. Give me a heartfelt reaction. Alright. Guys, got that moving on. I'm having trouble with the scene. Players making camp in the wilderness after crashing into unknown land. Ready to rest. <laughs> Perform a dab classic. Oh my god, he actually did it! Your player in his front are deciding who's going to try and fly across the Pickwick Bridge. Yeah, definitely rock, paper, scissors. Definitely. Should be enough. Sorry, the poses don't look good. Can you do it again? One more time. Oh my god. I don't think you're supposed to choose the same ones again. I think you're supposed Watch to choose the ones that actually this. make sense. You guys got that? Moving on. Should be enough. Sorry. Oh my god. Fine. I'll do the boring ones. <clears throat> Wait. What? Player and his friend are deciding who's going to... Yeah. Rock, paper, scissors. That one's that still one, right. The rock, paper, scissors made sense. Yeah. Make it rain. We didn't make it rain. You over there, are you the producer? Can you give us a hand too, please? Who just sent us a build? I'd love it if that's all he ever said. <clears throat> this new guy, is that you? That guy's we need some help. Okay. 
You have anything for that Inferno stage? Totally stuck on that one. See where you come in. Our Nance and I are working on the environment art, but we need some reference photos and we're never making the time. The pictures of places? Yeah, exactly that. We have requests from design, but we need some references. Yes. It's the Inferno stage. It's supposed to be a hellish place with fire and flames and all that stuff. You gotta fly an airship between these waterfalls of lava, lava falls, whatever. Looks like that. You need someone who's well traveled, so I guess the journeyman tamer is the ideal reference seeker. Second level, the player is a prisoner of the air pirates, so we're gonna need references for holding cells, dungeons, the works. So you get us some references for the ice world, that would be ideal too. Not like we've seen much of ice or snow in Denise. This camera just had a picture and send them straight away. Okay. <clears throat> okay, we got a camera. Yep, we got a camera to go take pictures of places when we go back. A fiery inferno, a dark dungeon, a world of ice. No, right where to find all those. Yep. We're sending as soon as you have the references, we'll start modeling straight away. Yeah. Okay. That guy needs something. He needs code. Yep. And so we must... Okay. So let's go downstairs one more to get that last thing. A sticker. Duality notes. That too. That too! <clears throat> The guy here before goes crazier. Very funny. Okay, Stocko, what's the setup's first setup then? I didn't look. Neither did I. And now? Unpogrify. <laughs> Prod QA. Oh, wait, can we stop and so we can look at it? <laughs> no. There's got to be a way to tell them I'm not going to help you right now and then check our inventory. Yeah. Alright. So, key items. Quest items. Um, duality notes. Okay. Configuration unpogrify. I knew it. Dev external. Okay. Configuration directives unpogrify dev external. <clears throat> the configuration. Yep. Unpogrify. Textures, right? Yep. Prod QA? Dev, dev external. Dev external, that makes sense. Thanks, Taco. Yeah, you're welcome, dude. What? Turn the lights off, please. <laughs> Richard, where are we implementing those stickers? How am I supposed to debug like this? So can you bring me a nice time for rubber time, please? Bring me an Ori. It's my fave, and it actually understands code being digital and all that. All right, I'll give mine over. No, I'm fine giving mine over. Oh, You've given it for the right last now. few times, huh? I just, I'm not going to use it, so it doesn't matter. I don't think I am either. But <clears throat> I think we're going to have to go downstairs again. For the Temporium, yeah. I have no idea what level we're on currently. It's quite the loading screen. I think this city takes a lot to run. Because every time we've walked into the city, it's done that. Neoito! All right. Let's see, uh, go ahead and grab yours if you're set that you want to give it up. Yep. All right. So it's in my second box. How cool is that? <clears throat> I too have a second. It's the only one in my second box though currently. Same. Oops. Look at you. We've. Here it is. <clears throat> sure, which one? I have one here. Here's quest six. Hand it over your quest six. Uh, just the thing. Thank you, Typo. Now sit with here with me here, Ori. Look, so this line here calls the flight animation. Once called, we kill the sleep here. And, oh, wait. Oh, I got it. It's right here. Staring me in the face. It was redirected. Here, Typo. Catch. Response status code 302 found. When the ally is targeted with an offensive digital technique, it gets redirected to the temp -tem. Oh. Kind of cool. Wow, that's really good against digital opponents, to be honest. Yeah. 
redirect things somewhere else. A little hacker trick. You can use it with digital tens. Don't tell them I taught you this. Huh, okay. I think I know, we're finally still, free. I know it still says question mark for that one, but I do think we are free now. We need the camera thing. Yeah. Alright, you ready? Well, apparently we can check with the QA team, but... Yeah, I'm gonna go to- I'm gonna go to the- Are we ready? I'm saying, are you- Oh, you want- you want to go grab another- Yeah, let's go downstairs. Yeah. Grab yourself another Tim Tim. Yes, sir. Put Kratos back in there. Oh my god. How long has it been since I've seen a, a bug in my room? Ready? I mean, it's not a big bug. It's like a gnat, but maybe slightly bigger. But it's been a long time since I've seen one. Well, I suppose now we have time for a more formal welcome. This is Neoito by Humble City. Welcome to Sapanku. His wounds are not like life threatening, but he's completely exhausted. Doctor Solomon just said he just needs a few days of rest and relaxation, so I had him sent to Onsenshima. Okay. Nothing good, that's for sure. He claims he's a deserter. I'd be skeptical about it if it wasn't for the way his comrades treated him. He might still be a double agent, so tread carefully with him. He's currently recovering in Onsenshima, like I said. That's west of town across the bridge. Can't miss it. I don't know, but we lose nothing for trying. We don't have that many clues. But there's another lead you want to check in. Carlos is in Nanto Labs investigating the digital disappearances. Last I heard from him, he's cross-examining the witnesses. As I told you in Kisuwa, digital prototypes have been disappearing from my lab for some time. Never managed to learn how or why, but now I suspect Clan Belsoto, of course. Carlos could surely use your help. If the Belsoto are behind the operation, we need to put a stop to it immediately, before they use those stolen digital temtem to strike again. Got it? Interrogate the wounded Belsoto and check on Carlos. Up to you, Congressional Agent. Just two. I'll instruct my people to cooperate with you, Satako. This is bigger than you, me, or Sapanku. The whole archipelago is at stake. <clears throat> no dojo yet, huh? Okay. We need to go west. And where's Nando Labs? Oh. Nando Labs is like right north of us. Yeah. That's what I'm like. I I'm like I knew it was in here. I'm like I just. No reason to run off. Main lab. Main lab. Sure. Rest assured, I will get to the bottom of this, and we'll know exactly how and why those digital temtems exist. Ah, oh, Satsuko, I guess you being here is bad news. It means you didn't manage to catch your prey? Huh, I hope she's not dissing my professional skills. Not joking. See this lot here? I've narrowed down the list of suspects to these three here. I'm sure it must be one of them. The person who's been stealing top-notch digital prototypes from Nanto Labs is in this very room right now. Dr. Wood, one of the researchers. Hamura, lab assistant. And Alberto, one of the cleaning boys. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Plenty and a few red herrings, too. What I need right now is a revise. You guys will do the man who smoked out the Belsoda spies from the Tassa Desert, no less. First, I'll give you a timeline of the night the last prototype disappeared. I've confirmed all of it so you can trust it happened. Then I suggest you interrogate the suspects one by one. And lastly, before you come back to me, I'd recommend you take a little tour of the whole lab, familiarize yourself with the building. And then? Then hit me up and we'll move to the Dunamois. Like they say in pretentious novels, that is, <laughs> is we'll go through the testimonies again and see if we can catch the culprit. Ready? Got it. Get my timeline straight. Interrogate suspects. Check the locations. Get back to you. Excellent. We need to nail this one, partner. It's almost gone again. This might be our only card against Flan Belsoto. We can't afford any mistakes. Ready? So in round seven, these three were the last ones on the first floor. Dr. Wood and Hamura were working on their computers. The ones on the western side of the room. Alberto was sorting the recycling by the elevator. At some point between eight and nine, Hamura got up and went somewhere else, then returned at nine. Alberto was seen leaving his place as well. At around ten, everyone went home. The receptionist was the last one and locked it all down. Got it? Ready to interrogate these suspects, or do you want me to run through the timeline again? Start with Dr. Wood. She looks suspicious to me. Ready to answer all the questions, but okay. <laughs> Why did you steal those Tempto? So I guess I worked all day here. I didn't leave the main lab, I don't think. And I guess I didn't see anything useful either. My desk is against the western wall, so all I can see is my screen. Sorry, I'm not much help. And then I left by 9, I think. I was the first one to leave. It doesn't make me a suspect, right? Could have been either of those two. Who knows what they were up to alone in here? Think of thieves. Nothing suspicious. Or more like nothing at all. My workstation's against the wall, like I said, so nothing. Sorry. No, not once. Well, actually, I went out for ramen at some point. I was getting peckish. Yeah, from 8 to 9. I mean, like that. Everyone has to eat, right? Right? I think you were done. I have no reason to steal anything. I love my job. This is surreal. You're a sidekick? Alright, let's be done with it. 
I spent all day working on a couple cordial inver- conversations with colleagues naturally and then I left at some point as Alberto. Like I said, Alberto, around 7.30 maybe, was about taking all the draft paper to recycling. Oh, and later I went up to have a chat with Tetsuya, one of the design guys. We played a board game for a minute to clear my mind. Dr. Tetsuya was still in her office so there unless you suspect her. Uh-huh. Interesting to know if Tetsuya confirms his alibi. Maybe I shouldn't say, but since these are exceptional circumstances, Dr. Wood went out that evening. She said she was going home for ramen, but now it sounds mighty suspicious, doesn't it? I want to check with that receptionist, Taco. It's Carlos. Or Alberto. Another detective. How excited? I mean, yes, officer. I answered a question. Just shoot. Yes, at some point I was up to design. Dr. Wood had told the archives had a lot of old stuff that should be sent to recycling, so I rode the elevator to third floor. She's one of the charge of the archives. I don't remember what time it was. We're checking that with Aya. I think it was like 10, maybe? Pretty late. I was chit-chatting with my friend Hamura. We went out together. The doctor was long gone by then. I don't mean to imply anything about that. That's it. No more questions. I mean, if you have more questions, I'm happy to answer them. It's definitely Alberto. Do you all of them? Have you checked their versions? I mean, I haven't verified any of it, but yeah. See, you said the secretary's on three? The receptionist here? Where were the recep- you think the receptionist be in the hall? On three, I think is what he said. But no, yeah. I don't know why I thought he said three. Maybe this is where Tetsu is supposed to That's be. That's where the archives were. Yeah, you're right. For Aya. We're looking for Aya. There she is. Alberto last night? Um, let me think. I don't think so. No, wait. Yes, we did. Very briefly. He asked me something about old files. I didn't have any time, so I said to leave it for today. But today, well, it's messy. Remember what time it was, but Dr. Sasai was in her office. That's all, thanks. That matches up. Yeah, it was a very brief convo, but yeah. Can I be of assistance? Uh, what time did everyone leave? I do recall Dr. Wood left first. It was still a bit early, and then the others who left together quite late. Maybe 10? I had to wait to lock up the place. We we'll leave at different points. Dr. Wood left and then came back, but that was at lunchtime, and if I recall correctly, they ran inventory much later, right? So if she'd smuggled something out, we'd have found out. Love Detective Series. Can you tell? I catch all the clever details. Anything else? Something out, thanks. Hmm. Hmm. Definitely feeling a bit like, to me, Dr. Wood. One chance. She went out during the day. Did she? At what time? Lunch time? Uh-huh. It's correct, but is it relevant? No, because uh, the robbery was later during the night. Because they checked inventory beforehand. So what's your final word on Dr. Wood? Be very careful, Satako. Perhaps or perhaps not. Let's move on to the next suspect then. Hamura, the lab assistant. We played a game with... Uh, corrected. If he claims they both saw Sasai in her office while they played, is that enough of an alibi? Um... You can't see your office from there. Exactly. Weird thing to lie about, isn't it? Almost like he's too anxious to prove his innocence. So final verdict on Hermura? Innocent. Go on to the last suspect then. Doesn't mean he must, must be the last one. She confirmed that. So he's not particularly suspicious in my book. So our Paisano Alberto, did he do it? Yeah. No! <laughs> I can prove it. I don't think so, buddy. Talk caught you fair and square. Surrender now and you'll have a fair. Can't explain, but no way. <clears throat> Where did he go? Running away. Get him before you lose him. Wait a second. Before you do have this, it'll help you capture him. Melicotton? Whoa! Oh my God. Whoa! Yeah, it's Stab Master is exactly what I thought it was. Stab is even better. It's plus are your stats as insane as my stats are? 37, 50, 50, 44, 47, 50, 44. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. This Momo is cracked. That's as good as Momo gets right there. Isn't it a happy peach? It'll serve you well, Sotaka. The best notes for tracking specific clues this side of the Solaro. 
you got most of the clues and found the culprit. One day you might be a great detective. You deserve more than a reward, more like a friend. Now go, catch him. Gotta catch them all. Am I right? Gotta catch them all! Gotta catch them all! Tim Tim up! You know what Gotta Catch Them All always reminds me of? Danny Pokemon? Phantom. Oh, okay. It's on you, dude. What a rude young lad. See a man running out of here? He's wearing lab clothes. Oh, that lad? Yes, I did bump into a young man running east like he was being chased by all the demons. I think he went into the rice fields. Thanks, bye. We need to go to the rice fields anyway. Alright, let's go east. To the rice fields. This way. To the We're rice fields. Go get out Do we want to get out Melicotodon? Um, am I going to use Melicotodon? Beak Unpopular is starting to fall off, is. isn't he? A little bit. I might use her instead of Beak? But Beak's only... God, it is a level 50. It's not like it's super behind level-wise. Uh-huh. Jesus. It already has 100 TVs in stamina. I love neutral types. Undermine is a great move, apparently. 125. And, and he can get double edge. Definitely a special attacker, when possible. Low priority, but good. I'm not taking it out quite yet, but if you want to, I wouldn't blame you. Uh... Man, the next island's got the mental, doesn't it, too? Which yeah. would mean my neutrals are even worse on the next island. And I've already got two. God, it's so good, though. As soon as I get my thing leveled, I think I'm going to take that up and use it for a while. That's pretty insane. It replaces the willpower drain that Beak has. That's true. Oh, and I have way too many electric weaknesses. I'm I'm probably gonna put Melicotonian over Beak for now. Do it, Melicoton. Do it. Do it. Do it. I'm glad I guessed what Stabmaster does correctly. Sorry. Don't disturb. Right. Don't disturb the rice harvest. All right, here's the rice field. A new area. And I think this might be a good place to stop because I know you're getting on with your brother in about seven minutes. So unless you want to maybe just grab our Temtem -tem in here. Yeah, maybe grab a Tem real quick. Let me see. Yeah. All right, so in here is 20% Babawa, 60% Ori, 20% Nestle. Wow. And if we go a little further, it's 20% Nestle, 20% Babawa, 60% Halsey, whatever Halsey is. Where's that? That's the second... Uh, that's, um, okay, this is hard to explain. You see this, uh, like, dumbbell in the middle in of the, the map? Yeah. yeah. The left side of that dumbbell, the grass around that, has okay. the 20% Nestle, 20% Babawa, 60% Halsey. Alright. And then the very center has 20% Nestle, 35% Saipat, 35% Whiplump, 10% Poopois, whatever Poopois is. Uh, the, the southeast... Has 20% Nestle, 20% Babawa, 60% Cycrox, whatever Cycrox is. Okay. And then the northeast, okay, is also 20% Babawa, 20% Nestle, 60% Cycrox. So basically the eastern half is 20% Babawa, 20% Nestle, 60% Cycrox. I think I might go for that over there. Okay. I might just look for typings first. Let me see. I'm just going to look what type they are. I think Ori is straight digital. What is a Halsey? Halsey is straight digital. Uh, Pupoise. Which I don't think I'll go for because there's too many things I don't want in that bush area. Yeah, that's my issue. Pupoise is digital nature. And then Cycrox is digital toxic. Ooh, I'm going there. I like toxic.
already does seem pretty good. We got our work cut out for us if you got to get to the all the way to the right. Surprise fight. Well, I ran into it intentionally. <clears throat> oh. See, like in the anime. Oh my god. Luali and Galvanid. Alright. I can stoneball Galvanid. It's just a slow move. Or I can sludge bomb Luali. I'll go after Luali, you go after Galvanid. Alright. Low priority, but because they're 41, I might go first, to be honest. Yeah, low priority went first. And this is improved because you're with me. Yep. It would have added two turns of burn, but... Chubby! I like to... Let's call it Chubby instead. Chubby! <laughs> I'm Crystal Bite Nestle. Okay, I'll major slash Chubby. Ooh, tough boy, that chubby. Not so tough, Nestle. Chubby's probably digital wind. Alright, I leave this one to you. Yeah, I got it. Save your... One more Damn, he's up. good! For a rando. <laughs> For a rando. Okay. I'll keep running. I'll go for a housey, just to... Let me know if you're ready. Um, yeah, I'm prepped. Go ahead. We, just, we had a temp temp, that's why. A temp trainer, so... <clears throat> I do gotta call it soon here. Obi Wan and Sapien. Obi Wan, really? I'm disgusted by you. That's funny. <laughs> All right, Zalbian is obviously a much tougher boy. I'm gonna yeah, let's stone go ball Zalbian. that. Between the two of us, we should Pickles. have it. Pickled. Nice. Two times on the lightning. That's nice to know. Oh, and a heat up. Yeah, we're going. So now he's sure. fire type. Now I have four times damage. I think. Did he just do that? Yeah, I do have. Sorry, dude. I think I do you four might do, times. Yeah, if you do four times, that's going to be pretty sweet. No, it's two times. Two times, still but still got enough. Still enough times. Well done. And I healed back up full. That's always nice. Cycrox. There's Cycrox. Okay, this is what okay. I'm going for. Digital Toxic. I got. I probably got to get out. Yeah, it's Toxic. You got to You got to bail. No, Toxic's the other one. Cycrox toxic is bubble. Digital Toxic. Huh? Yes, yeah. The tank is Talks fine with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna slash Cycrox. Because Toxic's just a lot to deal with. Swarm. I'm, I'm gonna Meteor Swarm, see how it does. Should be normal against both of them. I would think so. <clears throat> Wastewater? Gross? That's so cool. Oh! Bubba's doomed! Yeah, you gotta use one of those things I gotta that use gets a, rid of I gotta use a full restore and all heal, or he's dead. That's yeah, so it. messed up. Or, do you want to attack it? What is, uh, I'll use a full restore, you attack. Um, all healer should heal it. it. says heal all status conditions. Oh, that's what I meant, sorry. All heal, that's what I meant. You're gonna all heal? Okay. Yeah. Okay, then I'll fierce claw it, yeah. Bro, that's messed up. That's the first we've seen that. I'm yep. so excited for that, though. If I, if I catch that. That's messed up. Obi-Wan just overexerted himself. I would have to name that Kenobi. Oh, of course. Alright, go ahead and finish it off. You're welcome. Thank you. Bro, that's nuts. That's rude is what that is. That's cool. And it would fill two typings we don't have, digital and toxic. I know, that's why that's why I want it. Shiratama. Hey, what's that behind you? Nice try. <laughs> he 
you few said what? CJ. <laughs> Alright, you wanna You goof. Oh, I have to go through oh I have yeah, you're right, I have a ways to go, don't I? Yes, we do. Well I can go to the northeast, because isn't that also where northeast, I can get from? Yeah, where yeah. Okay, so if you want in here, you can grab it in no, here. No, I'll I'll back you up just in case you miss. Whoops. Or accidentally walk into a tam tamer. Alright. Hedgeine. Digital fire? fire. It gotta be. These are so cool. I'm all about it. That should be two times weak to stone ball, so we'll throw that out there. Gotta go fast! <laughs> That's funny. Sonic. Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. Gotta go faster, faster, faster. Yep, yeah, it's digital fire for sure. Major slash. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, interesting. Yeah, look at that. Well That's done. cool. That's cool. Kratos 49. Kratos only has 37 stamina. Very concerned. All right, you just gotta make it through this patch, and you're in the clear. There you go. That's the one you're looking for. Go up here, right? That's the one you're looking for. Up here. The one right down your stairs here, or up the stairs, I guess, if they're up. All right. Uh, let me disband, I guess. That's fine. I'm not gonna attract anything for a while, so. Okay. I'm gonna go for the Housley here, I guess. We don't even know what that is, so I'll give it a look. 60%. I, just, I have my major thing on. I used one of those major ones, so. Oh, I, well, I did get an attraction. Okay, here we go. What did I get? A Babawa. Devastation. That's alright. Not the end of the world. Devastation, no breathing. Don't give up. Give up. I'm breathing. There's a lot of tamers over here. Alright, we'll see if I can get a housey here. Wow. I did get a housey. Congrats. Milkathon and Valash. Level 46. Alright, I don't want to kill it. I don't think that would kill it, but we'll be safe with it. Throw a temp card plus. Swing and a miss. Plasma beam, okay. Alright, another nibble. And temp card plus. Got it. Uh equal spread of green, orange, and red. Very average. Right. Looks like its tax stat is good though. Alright, oh Halsey. God. I'm gonna call you. Yeah, oh my god. Yeah, that's pretty dope. What? What happened? That's pretty dope too. Attack and defense are both 50. 45 wow. speed, 38 special attack, 20 special defense, 15 stam, 15 HP. <laughs> that's pretty decent Babawa. That's a very decent backup to Captain Bawa. Uh... I'll call him Lazor. I have no idea what to call him. If you want to come to me, come to me. Um, we did skip a lot. And then we can actually do this place properly next time. Okay, then I'll come to you. Go back to the very beginning then. Yeah, we can smoke bomb. I'm not smoke bombing. Okay. Oops! 
I just accidentally engaged a tamer. Not surprised. Sorry, dude. I was trying to is get it out. The, is it the white coat lady in the middle? Yeah. Alright, I'll fight her real quick. What does she start with? Uh, Tataru and uh, uh, Wolfie. Okay. So Wolfie's Wolfie. dead. And Tataru's taking out a water cup Lily. Forgot about that. Forgot Tataru has that. What's that? Uh, Tank just took a rock to the face. Oh, yeah. So Tank's getting the hell out. Yep, he does. Actually, Tank's. No, Tank's gonna do that. And Bawa's gonna go ahead and heal Tank just to be safe. Brutal. Chromian, huh? I might be losing tank here. Uh oh. You kept them in. Yep, I'm losing tank. Wow. No, by 7 HP. 7 HP, the man's here. He just hit, and I, I'm not kidding, he literally just ate two stone moves in one turn. Yikes. And survived it. Not the plan. No, but I'm actually kind of happy that he can do that. As long as they're underleveled. Very oh nice, Tank. Gosh. Very nice. Could have been worse. Um, yeah. Um. I might go ahead and... Uh, get him off, he's gone. Flaming meteorite. Drop the nuke. Doesn't even need to be super effective. Still just a one shot. God, I love that move so much. Jaws is out here. Sam and Jaws, both 66 in the same fight. That's cool. 60, you hit it. It was 60. I knew it! And now I'm going to miss the evolution. Son of a bitch. Alright, now I am smoke Oh my god, Grumper's stats are insane. Let's go. He, he picks it up. Chromion? I don't even know what this thing is. It looks like the lower evolution of the thing you were trying to catch. Oh, probably. Alright, healing up. Tataru's out, so now I've just got this Chromion to go. Let's see, what's he got here? Mental Torment. Okay, so that went on Spike. I probably should get him out. Not Spike out. Let's leave Spike in. Let's have him do... Yeah, let's do that. And let's have you get out just to be safe. Let's put in... Let's put Winner in. Do I go back to Beak? Man. Might take Beak over Melikaton. It's so good, but like also it's Man. I don't know, I'm gonna have to think about that one in between the next episode and now. Well I'm glad Tank survived two stone two times fours with seven HP. Yeah, that was a... Yeah. Oh. That would have been a I bummer. thought for sure. I thought he was gone. So, um, you remember how we talked about, um, smoke bombing out? Yeah, I'm smoke bombing out. Yeah, I did already. Phew. All right, I'm going to call the recording here and then we'll pick up next time. Rice fields. Oh Dude, this, this sixth dojo has to be so much higher level than the fifth dojo. It's been so long since we've been in the dojo. <laughs> Crazy.
All right, Grumper, we got you to 60. So, oh my god, he's got... When he got to... Si oh my god, 60, he gets Electric Storm, Sparks, Thunderstrike. Like, so many... All the stuff. 